Unit 4, can you believe we're here already? So, in Unit 3, we went over some of the basics of HTML and CSS for layout, for lists, for colors, for formatting, all that stuff. Now, in Unit 4, we're going to get a little more complex with organization using HTML and CSS. In other words, what we're going to do is we're going to spend a lot of time looking at laying out our pages using CSS. So, in the previous sections we were primarily concerned with like you know formatting the font sizes the color things like that here what we're gonna do is we're gonna use things called like IDs and divisions and things like that to really lay out our web pages now when you go to most of real high-end websites I don't know like uh, you know Facebook or CNN or any of the big companies that you can think of that have a heavy online presence most if not all of those companies really depend on CSS for the layout of their pages. And we're going to learn how to get a little more complicated than what we've been doing in the past with some of our layouts. So let's go ahead and get started.